A high-tech solution could cause speeding drivers in Macon County to think twice. Today, the Tuskegee Police Department officially launched a new program they hope will save lives. WSFA 12 News reporter Brady Talbert explains. Thaleen Dawson Williams lives in Tuskegee and often walks down Chappie James Drive, which she says used to be more dangerous. Oh boy, especially when the trucks was here too. They come down the road just like they was on the freeway. But recently, something's been slowing them down. At least it's starting to. Most of them slow down. Those that come through that don't know about it, no. The Tuskegee Police Department has installed these speed cameras at multiple locations. It's a part of the department's new traffic safety initiative, which is designed to prevent crashes and save lives. I've seen a child die as far as for an accident, so my main concern is making sure that everyone is okay. The Tuskegee Police Chief stresses her officers will still conduct traffic stops. This new technology is just an added bonus. If a driver is speeding past one of these cameras, it records their license plate and sends it to police. The police department reviews it and a police officer decides whether or not a citation is going to be issued. Tickets would arrive in your mailbox and you could pay up to $150. It's an added incentive to follow the law and consider the people who live here. Kids play back across these roads, ride bicycles, and it's not safe. Brady Talbert, WSFA 12 News. The speed cameras were activated in January, but have only been sending warnings to drivers who go above the speed limit. Some 3,000 drivers have received one, but starting tomorrow, speeding tickets will start arriving in mailboxes.